Hello and welcome to Kimmer Acts. I'm Kim and today we're going to watch the episode um, 32 of Fairy Tale. And my reaction to episode 33 is also now available for early access on my Patreon page. Please check it out in the link in the description down below. It's only for $1 a month. Then you'll have an early access to all of my reaction videos. And it would really help support a lot with me on this channel. And please um, check it out. Uh, consider checking it out in the description down below. And also, I would like to give a special shout out and thanks to my Patreon, Grace, for supporting this channel. And if this is your first time here, consider subscribing so you'll be updated whenever I upload my reaction videos. And without further ado, let's start watching this episode and see what will happen. 3, 2, 1, start. And last episode was really crazy because we learned about um, Loki that he, he is Karen's celestial spirit. And now he's saying that he killed her master. But it's possible that I guess I heard that, that very loyal saying with Aquarius. But so I'm thinking maybe um, Leo was had oh we really learned about the about the card now <laughs> she has her, her own heart Iris <laughs> <laughs> so <laughs> yeah <laughs> so she's a cruel master so maybe that's why <laughs> you had to kill her the spirit king so maybe the slayer And spirits are not usually loyal. It depends, I think, on the spirit case. Aquarius doesn't really obey Lucy that much. So she really had a attitude problem. So <laughs> she used her as a shield. <laughs> Poor Aris. So I think Oh So I think that's possibly what happened. So she really is Very arrogant and abusive. Whoa. So Leo had really, I think Leo really had to kill her, maybe save the other celestial spirits. So the two of them. Yeah. 
going to kill you. Yeah, it's too much. The other spirits fear their kiss. So how come she became the the most famous? How come she became the most famous celestial wizard if she's or maybe she really is she's great at finding or maybe using spirits but how can she able to use the spirits correctly if they don't respect her as much as she disrespects the spirits you can't call any other yeah she is so she's not that really a great mage so so maybe she used her her influence or maybe her looks to become famous yeah <laughs> oh. like a boss <laughs> But that would get her mad even more. I think she will put all of that anger to Aris by the time Leo Oh he's the leader. So he so he's the most powerful Celestial Spirit. Or maybe just as old or maybe there are other kinds of keys. Oh, he's still been able to. That's how much magical power he has. I don't think so. Oh, maybe, maybe Iris will kill, will try to kill her, and then Leo will stop. Because I don't think Leo would really kill his master, her, his master. Oh, maybe he really already killed her. What happened? Oh, the guild master. Oh, she died. And she doesn't have a sinister spirit, so that's why. That sucks. Up. <laughs> so that's why he says. Uh, I think she killed Gavin. And I think it would really hurt the spirit if their master died. But still, she is, she is pretty abusive and arrogant. And she treated spirits like tools, so. I think uh, I hope Lucy will save him. Oh, 
Oh, they're scouting. She's there, yeah. So she was the the woman who keeps showing with uh, Loki. So maybe she he she can make a contract with him. <laughs> His conscience is killing him. But she is really. I don't think she deserves Leo and Alice. Yeah, so that's why he hated Celestial Wizards because of Karen. Take him. <laughs> so maybe she is an exception. And yes, I think she was able to forcefully summon one of the spirits. I think it was Taurus. <laughs> I think she can. <laughs> yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh, what happened? Oh, Spirit King. But he didn't kill, he didn't really kill Karen directly. Oh. <laughs> so.
Oh, which is how much? Which is how much all of them at once? All at once? Yeah. So now, she, will she be able to complete all of the zodiacs? I guess Aris is not there. Um. <laughs> so maybe that that would give an exemption for Leo. Yeah, <laughs> and now Lucy will have one of the most powerful Celestial Spirit. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, be grateful to lose. <laughs> she was really passionate. Yeah. Help Lucy, Lucy instead. Now Lucy has a pow powerful uh, ally. Now she has four golden keys, I think. <laughs> now she's falling. He's falling head over heels. To Lucy. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> He's just going to get He's treating them. <laughs> She's already packed and ready to go. Oh. 
Ah. <laughs> oh, I got cheers with that. So they come before I'm the star. Okay, so that was uh, another great episode. And uh, yeah, <laughs> now Lucy has Loki as his uh, as her new uh, celestial spirit, and he's one of the strongest, I think, um, celestial spirit of the zodiacs. And uh, Lucy was great that she was able to summon all of his uh, celestial spirits all at once, and he was, she was able to uh, negotiate with the king, <laughs> with the spirit king, and even. Insult, <laughs> insult him, but I guess he just realized how great the heart Lucy has for his friends, especially with Loki, and also Loki has co uh, concern with and care for Lucy, and he he didn't really meant to kill um, Karen as I as I as I expected, knowing how uh, good a guy Loki is. It's just that directly so, and. Karen was really abusive and I think she, she really was uh, she would really had it coming since uh, I think if not Loki maybe some other spirit might uh, be make uh, could turn against her seeing how she abused them and treats them as tools instead, instead of uh, a spirit and as a partner maybe as a friend and so at least now Lucy has a, a new powerful ally which is Loki and, and uh, it's, good, it's also a good thing that Loki would don't Loki doesn't have to disappear and he will help and he will be able to repent with his sin by helping out Lucy instead so but um, the last part with the episode was really, it gave me chills when uh, Lucy said that Later, that I found out that that's, that was the last time. Uh, I I will see Erza smile. So I hope she won't die. <laughs> I think she's a ma she said she's too big of a character and too a major character of the fairy tale. So and I don't think she they will kill her that easily. <laughs> hope not. But she's one of my favorite characters as well. And I think maybe we'll we'll go now to the. A backstory of Urza because we doesn't we don't we don't really know much about Urza until now except for the guy who is at the council I think they have uh, uh, history in the past and I think she was still little when she arrived at fairy tale with Natsu and Grey so that's when they met and I wonder what history they had so maybe they, they were where when they were even kids they had a terrible connection with the dark guild or something like that so i think that would be the start of a new arc and i think this time um, instead of saving lucy or maybe gray now you will they will uh, try to save one of the strongest wizards of fairy tale which is urza and uh yeah i'm excited to see that so how, how about you guys what are your thoughts on this episode just leave a comment down below and let me know and if this is your first time here consider subscribing and if you enjoyed watching the video please click the like button down below and also please check out my patreon page there's also an early access for my episode 33 reaction it's only for one dollar a month and it would really help me a lot with this channel and you will have an early access to all of my reaction videos 
and uh, that's pretty much it thanks for watching see you in my next session video goodbye